In high school, I've experienced bullying firsthand when it comes to boys. There are many times when I have felt bullied, but something more meaningful to me is when I have stood up for someone being bullied. I don't know if this relates to bullying in that sort of way, but being in any type of sports position or sports leadership position, it's kind of hard because sometimes your whole team like doesn't agree with you or kind of doesn't like what you're saying and kind of talks about you and that is pretty hard when you're in that position. <laughs> Boys are very immature and can say some pretty hurtful things not knowing the damage that it causes. I have experienced boys talking behind my back and it has really lowered my self-esteem. I heard a group of girls talking about one of my friends in a really bad way. People often talk about you behind your back and not always agree with what you say even though that's the position that you're in. You might not think the words you say get back to people but they always do. Oftentimes, I feel like it's a lot easier to just remain quiet than to speak up and say something. People often talk bad about you behind your back and not always agree with what you have to say. The things that were said about me stayed in my head for weeks and nothing could get those thoughts out of my mind. I was really afraid to do something at the beginning, but I realized if I was in that position, I would want someone to do the same. Even though that's the wrong position that you were chosen for, when they talk about you or anything like that, it kind of hurts your feelings and not make you feel very good about yourself. The only thing that really helped me was when I had a really close friend reach out to me. But this time, I felt like I really needed to speak up to stop this. Something that really helped is having a friend with me in that position that really understood what I was going through and that I could trust and that we could go through it together. This friend stood up for me and really had my back. This really helped because I knew I had a friend I could trust. In the nicest way possible, I asked these girls to change the subject to stop talking about my friend in such a harsh way. Just us reaching out and really being there for each other really made a big difference. The things the boys said about me didn't matter because she made me realize they weren't true. Later, one of those girls in that group reached out to me and told me that they were glad that I said something because they were also thinking about saying something and they wanted the conversation to stop as well. Without this friend helping me, I would not have the self-confidence I have today. This friend has no idea how much she helped me just by reaching out. That friend who was being bullied reached out to me saying how she appreciated me standing up for her even if she wasn't there. I've never regretted that decision to stand up for one of my friends. This is your sign to stand up and reach out. This is your sign to stand up and reach out. Now this is your sign to stand up and reach out. Standing up and reaching out for your friend can do more than you know. Bullying is sadly such a big problem in today's world and society, and just being a good friend is really a good way to help lesser that problem.